Our top story tonight, we have an update on a story we brought you last week about the recall of Jonesboro Mayor James Harris. NBC 10 Sydney Lane is in the studio and has the latest. Sydney? Hey Kyla, a recall petition by the Fit to Fight for Justice and Equality group led by former Mayor Leslie Thompson was overturned by the Court of Appeal. Mayor Harris spoke with me on the subject. They won a court case here uh, at the district level and uh, adding 49 names back to the recall petition, which gave them more than enough names to, um, to have the recall done. Um, and it was taken by the state attorney general's office. It was taken to the Court of Appeals, which overturned that ruling. Now, mind you, there were over, they turned in about 811 names. They had well over 100 names disqualified. And only 49 of those names were contested. And they were contested because the, um, the law, uh, they thought, stated that the Register of Voters did not have the authority to remove names from the, the petition. We learned why former Mayor Thompson called for a recall. Um, he stated that there was some uh, disparities uh, with the voting machines, uh, but the state did not receive any complaints. Uh, the uh, Secretary of State didn't receive any of those complaints. In his mind, those were some issues that happened. He's contesting his loss. Mayor Harris expressed where the town and him go from here. It's the same as we've always been doing. We're, I'm not focused on that. That was just a distraction from what I'm trying to, where I'm trying to take Jonesboro. Mayor Harris is eager to continue the progress of the town, which includes lots of exciting things like a food truck park. Reporting for your Arkhamus News Source, I'm Sydney Lane.